God is good in the midst of the darkness. That's what the definition of love is. Unconditional love. Everything is like quiet. As the world stood still, he took to his knees. This man called Jesus Christ, who took his life so that he could be our sacrifice. The Son of God was his name. He did the impossible, healed the lost and the unlovable. He controlled the weather and his feet did not quiver. But why? Why would he die? An innocent man. How could it all be over? Or was it just time for a makeover? Because three days later, the stone was gone. It was time to move on. His body was gone and the stone removed, but where had he gone? Has he risen? How could a man just like you and I perform such a trick? But you must know now, it was no magic trick. No disappearing games, just plain old Jesus ways. Because if you met this guy, you would know there was something different. Because all he ever wanted to do was listen, even when he was sat in a prison. He showed love like they had never seen before, felt grief, pain and regret. But somehow he knew there was a way to fix it all. No medication or drugs, just straight up love. And we aren't talking about some cute lovey-dovey love. We're talking about some straight up raw stuff. Pure, undeniable, uncontainable love. Because his love is like a river, bursting its banks. It cannot be contained and it has no specific way. It flows and flows because that's the way that he chose. But now it's your chance. Step up to the plate. He's calling you in. He died for you so that we can live a life that was brand new and full of breakthrough. This love will never give up. It'll fight and fight. It does not count your failures or mistakes of the past. This love is for everyone. Black, white, gay, straight, young and old. It's calling you in. This love is only one step away because we are bought by blood and saved by grace.